Hi, my name is Charlie Freda. I'm an artist in cohort 16 at the Guild Hall at SMU. This is the first video in a series on how to make, how to set up a scale for a menu. Uh, for these videos, we'll be using the May 2011 version of VDK, Adobe Flash Professional CS 5.5, and Adobe Photoshop CS 5. The first thing that I want to mention is how to format your Photoshop files. Um, to begin with, the sizes all need to be in a power of 2. So you need to have like 256 by 512, 1024 by 512, things like that. If you're not really sure um, what powers of 2 are, you can always go to Wikipedia, Google power of 2 or anything like that, and you can find a chart that has the values listed for you. So I have an image here that we're going to use as a button later in other videos and it's 1024 by 256 so it's the right size it's supposed to be but it's a PSD file. Now you're going to need to uh, save it as a PNG file instead so you just go to file and save as and uh, change it to a PNG. Oh and also um, I just want to note that since you're setting these things up for Flash and uh, UDK scale form, you might as well go ahead and start saving things into uh, UDK folders. So you're going to go to UDK, uh, UDK, then to UDK game, with Flash, and then this right here is just what I've called my folder. Uh, so set up your folder inside the Flash, basically, and start putting your PNGs in there. And then your your Flash files will also go in those folders. Okay, so then we'll just. And once you have it saved, you can then go into Flash and import it. And I'll show you that in just a second. Alright, so inside of Flash, you're going to go to File, and then Import, and Import to Library. Click on that. And then scroll to wherever your file is at, and it's right here in the PNG file that we just see. So open that, and that's going to put it over here. And there's a few things that you're going to have to do now to have everything work happening. So you're going to right click on this and then come down to properties. And that'll bring up this window. Now what you need to do is take off the, uh, the dot PNG. And then you need to click on allow smoothing and make sure that the compression is set to lossless. And then you need to go on to the next tab, the Action Script tab, click on it, and click on Export for Action Script. And that's going to automatically put the name down in here for you. And then you click on the Export run for Runtime Sharing. And in the URL, you're just going to put in whatever the file is that you're going to export. And then you click OK. The next thing you need to do is go to Properties, and right here where it says Publish Settings, you need to click on that, and you need to make sure that this HTML is not checked, so just click off of it, and then where it has the Flash Player, you want to make it Flash Player 8, and make sure that this says Action Script 2.0, and then hit OK. And so then you can just go to file and save as the flash file, and name it whatever you want, make sure you've got it saved in your flash, whatever you've named your folder, and click save, and that'll have you uh, ready to do the rest of the videos. And in the next video, we're going to go over how to create this right here, this scale form launcher, how to install it and set up the FX Media Player.